Hello everyone and welcome to my video. My name is Mahdi Dadfar. Today and in this video we will learn about two different types of amidation reaction for surface functionalization or surface modification. In my previous video that I already published and also you can find the link for that at the end of this video. I explained to you about two different types of surface functionalization. I mean about esterification reaction and also silenization reaction. But today and in this video, I'll explain uh, to you about two different types of amidation reactions. At the end, if you like my video, please push the like, press the subscribe button, and also share it with your friends. Now, let's start the video. As I already mentioned, we will learn about two different types of amidation reaction. The first one is NHS or n hydroxysuccinamide ester amine reaction. Uh, it's a reaction between a primary amine and also NHS ester product will be an amide that's why we call this reaction amidation reaction here and in this slide you can see general schematic for doing this reaction first we need to cover the surface of substrate with amine substrate can be everything substrate can be gold can be silicon glass diamond and everything else and for this purpose i mean we need to cover the surface of ammonia and we can use uh, plasma we can use ammonia plasma and after two minutes we will have a lot of amine on the surface after that we need to dissolve our compound in dissolved uh, solvent and immerse the substrate in this solution for half an hour maximum one hour ph is very very important please note ph should be between seven to nine and after half an hour or one hour we can wash the substrate now we have our compound on the surface and here you can see the rr can be different we can change the r i mean r can be different functional groups for example uh, R can be Tyon, I mean after doing NHS uh, ester reaction we can have Tyol on the surface. Sometimes uh, we would like to cover the surface or with a vitamin. Here you can see vitamin B7 or biotin, so, I mean sometimes we would like to cover the surface with biotin, vitamin B7. Again in this case we can use NHS ester amine reaction after reaction we will have biotin on the surface sometimes we would like to do kilic reaction on the surface i mean uh, we can function we can use nhs or amine reaction to cover the surface with alkyne or malamide when we cover the surface with alkyne we can do thioline or spaa estrogen promoted alkyne azide uh, cycle addition i mean two different types of kilic reaction and also when we cover after doing NHS or amine reaction and when we cover the surface with malamide we can use we can do thiolon michael cycle addition that it's another type of kilic reaction uh, the second type of amidation reaction is EDC coupling reaction EDC coupling reaction again it's a reaction between carboxylic acid group and a primary uh, amine product will be an amide that's why again we call this reaction uh, amidation reaction but please note we need to use EDC EDC or ethyl dimethyl aminopropyl carbodamide it's very important we need to use this catalyst to do this reaction again in the presence of this catalyst this reaction can be done very fast I'm, I mean in one hour this reaction can be done here and in this slide you can see general schematic for doing this reaction again we need to cover the surface with amine for this purpose we need to use a plasma and i mean we need to use ammonia plasma and after again two minutes we will have a lot of amine on the surface in next step we need to dissolve our compound in desert uh, solvent and immerse the substrate in this uh, solution and leave it for uh, one hour and after washing now we will have our compound on the surface again we can change the R R can be different functional groups for example R can be thiol I mean after S, after this reaction between carboxylic acid group and amine on the surface we will, we will have thiol on the surface I mean we will have thiol terminated surface sometimes we need to have benzene on the surface again after doing this reaction it is a coupling reaction we will have uh, benzene on the surface here you can see a structure of a glycine glycine is an amino acid you know in the structure of all of the amino acid uh, there is carboxylic acid group i mean we can use this reaction to cover the surface with different types of amino acid depends for example if you want to 
cover the surface with glycine, you can use this reaction. I mean, after reaction between carboxylic acid group and amine on your surface, we will have amine on your substrate. And also, again, you can use uh, this type of amidation reaction for doing click reaction. I mean, for example, here you can see uh, difluorinated cyclooctane, and this side uh, there is carboxylic acid group. And after doing reaction, we can have alkyne, and then in the following, we can do click reaction. And now, and in this slide, I would like to investigate gold uh, as an example. I mean, uh, for gold, it is a little, it's a little bit different. Uh, I mean, when we have gold and we want to functionalize gold, we don't need to use any functional group on the surface. I mean, we don't need to have hydroxyl or an H2 amine on the surface. But please note, we, note, we need to have toyol in our compound. I mean, when we have toyol in the structure of our compound, we can functionalize gold without any functional group on the surface. Let me give you an example. For example, we have this compound. In one side, we have NHS, and this side, we have toyol. I mean toyol without any functional group on the surface of gold, it can be connected to the surface of gold. I mean, we don't need to have anything on the surface of gold. Or for example, here again, you can, you can see uh, another compound with a carboxylic acid group and toyol. I mean, if you would like to have carboxylic acid group on the surface, and as you, your compound has toyol, you can functionalize gold without any functional group on the surface. I mean, this compound can be connected to the surface from this side, from toyol side, and now after that you will have carboxylic acid group on the surface. Or for example, here you can see a structure of histamine. Histamine uh, has an H2 in one side and other side it has toyol. Toyol can be connected, connected directly to the surface of gold and other side we will have an H2 or amine. It means we have uh, amine terminated surface. So, uh, thanks for watching my video. I hope it was useful for you. If you like my video, please push the like, press the subscribe button, and share it with your friends. And also, you can hit the bell. In this case, you, in this case, you will get notification whenever uh, I publish and upload a new video. Thanks again. And at the end, please don't forget, life is short and enjoy it. Thank you so much. Bye.